Hey guys, we're gonna start the vlog off with an unboxing. I'm so excited for this. This is from the company Thread Tank, and they let me pick a couple of t-shirts, and I cannot wait to see what they look like in person. They had, oh, I like the packaging. It says stories you can wear. They had so many, I had such a hard time deciding on which two to get, and I'm definitely gonna have to go and buy some more because they were so cute. They had like mom tees and um, like if you like dogs or wine, like all the typical things they had, but they were like so much like more clever and cute and funny. So I will show you guys the ones that I ended up getting. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And they gave me a discount code. It is the new mom for 10% off your whole purchase and I'll put it down below with their website and everything. But the first one I got, oh my gosh, they're so soft too. I love like when they're really, really soft t-shirts. So the first one I got <laughs> says, have kids, it's fun. I thought this was so funny. It's like a blush pink too and it's kind of a heathered um, color. It's really cute. I'll try them on for you guys. but. Okay, the next one I got, wait for it, wait for it, Slay at Home Mom. Stop, I'm so excited to wear this. Okay, let me go try them on. All right, so here's the Slay at Home Mom. So cute. And I got a size small, so it fits like, basically like a size small, but if you wanted it to be like more looser or something, I would go up a size, but it's pretty like true to size. So this is a small on me. So cute. And here's the other one that says, have kids, it's fun. This is just like so me, like so sarcastic. And like I can just picture myself with my crazy humans all over me while I'm wearing this shirt, just smiling, a big, huge grin. <laughs> But anyways, use the link down below and use my code if you want to get 10% off. I think they're really cool and thank you Thread Tank for sending me these t-shirts. Good morning guys. Um, I'm like as far away as possible from both of the boys right now because they're both napping and I don't want to wake them. Cal's fine. He always naps good but Crew, he fell asleep in the bouncer which we keep in our bathroom. It's like a little like bouncer that vibrates and he fell asleep in it while I was showering so that's why my hair is wet because I didn't want to turn on the blow dryer and wake him so I thought I would tiptoe over here and update you guys on how they're doing um crew is doing so much better like he is like may maybe coughing and sneezing like just a tiny bit but for the most part he seemed like a new baby like he's totally better um Cal on the other hand he kind of got worse and he started because like when we were there at the doctor's she checked him she said he didn't have any ear infections and he probably just had a regular cold um but he's gotten worse like he's been coughing more um coughing so much where he gagged and like threw up one day so um but he seems to be getting over, over it too he's just today he's just really really snotty so it's friday we went to the doctor on monday and now we've just been home every day this week and for me like I just can't, like it just drives me crazy I hate being home all day long with no other humans here besides my two children that can't really talk <laughs> so I gotta get out of the house I've been wanting to go to the gym so bad but I know like I can't I'm not gonna take them because they're sick so I went I tried I almost was gonna go and then as soon as I um was about to leave Cal threw up so I was going to meet David after work and he was going to take the boys home and then I was going to go to the gym and then that's when Cal threw up. So I haven't been in the gym yet. It's been driving me crazy. Um, but it's okay because I'm taking care of my babies. But I have thought maybe I need to get one of those bicycles, like a spin bike, and put it in our basement. That would be so cool because I feel like on days like this when I can't leave the house or I can't, I can't take them to daycare. Like if I just had a 30 minutes of cardio and like it's freezing cold outside, I'm not gonna like run outside. And I'm not like, I'm not into like doing a workout like on the carpet of my house. Like I don't wanna like do like a at home workout. In fact, most of the workouts that I do, I could do at home. I just like, it's just weird for me to like do it at home. But I think if it was just like a spin bike, I could totally get into that. Um, 
I think there's different apps and stuff and there's probably YouTube videos of different like spin workouts so you could watch it and like you know follow an instructor so I want to get one <laughs> they're not that expensive they're only like a uh, little over $200 on Amazon and I'm gonna save up for one because I think that that would be really nice let me know if you guys have any I put it on Instagram a lot of people said that they have them and they like it's so worth it so that's that update the boys and not getting out of the house also my last video of what I ate in a day I kind of talked about trying to lose weight and I'm using my fitness pal so I have lost seven pounds already using it and it's just like crazy just tracking my calorie intake and trying to stay within 1800 calories a day I've been losing so much weight so I'm super excited even though I haven't been working out I may have lost a little bit of muscle so we'll kind of see what happens but I'm excited that it's actually working and like I said I've never stuck to like any sort of diet ever so this is really good for me and I've been making like I just noticed like the salad dressing we had last night it was like 160 calories for two tablespoons. So it's like next time I go grocery shopping, I'm going to be more cautious and like look and see which dressing like would be better for us. So yeah. Anyways, I think we're going to go <laughs> to Target today. <gasps> Are you surprised? I'm not either. I just got to get out of the house. Like I can't stay in here all day, especially it's Friday. Like I want to like get out like get a coffee I want to go get a big Starbucks at Target and we'll probably just walk around I don't need anything so I'm sure I'll buy stuff but yeah that's our plan a juice box yeah and you do want a juice box yeah we're having lunch what time is it it's like 2 2 30 this is what happens when we don't leave the house in the morning and go to the gym we're just like lazy all day yeah. What are you eating? I eat cookie. You're having your cookie before you have anything else. Yeah. Oopsie. Okay, baby's crying. Crew just woke up. Hey. Did you take your sock off? Do you want to come out? together they're like always laughing at each other now it's so horrible I just got um some shorts and I'm curious to see how these are gonna look on me I'm not gonna try them on right now but they're from Gymshark and they're like that new trend of like the the biker shorts I just think they're kind of cute I don't know or maybe they're weird <laughs> they kind of look like men's boxers I don't know. I just thought they're cute. So they're like high waisted. They're like a rose <coughs> color. They're, that's his cough that he's pal's got. And then they've got like the Gymshark logo on the back. But yeah, they're like a biker short for the gym. I don't know. We'll see. We will see. I think they're kind of cute though. I also got some from that website called Sheen, I think. It's like a super, super cheap website. One. Someone had sent it to me. Um, on Instagram, so I was talking about the black biker shorts, and they said Sheen has some for like 12 bucks. So I ordered them from Sheen, like to wear with like t shirts and stuff in the summertime, like just a black tight biker short instead of a legging. I don't know, it could be a really bad trend, it could be really bad, but I'm gonna try it out. Just made my lunch. Cal, did you know the crew is five months old? There's you when you're five months old. Oh my gosh. I always go back and watch my videos with Cal when he was that same age as crew because it's fun to see like how different they are or some of the things that they do the same. And it also kind of jogs my memory of things that I might want to talk about when I film crew's five month update. So I'm going to watch that. Just having some leftover 
chicken and orzo that I made last night for dinner. Hey, don't do that. And then we're gonna go to Target as soon as we're done eating. All right, we're in the car. We're gonna go to Target, but I stopped at the mailbox. I have like, it's been like four days since I've checked the mail. And I think these are those shorts I was literally just talking about. They are. I wonder if they're gonna be any good. I've never ordered from that website before. It's like super, super cheap. No. No, they're like shiny. Don't play music. They're like shiny. Oh my God, I'm in the neighborhood and now there's like all these people driving and staring at me. They're shiny. They're like Leah, they're like dance pants, shorts. I don't know. I'm probably gonna, I'll try them on and see if I like the style. And if I like the style, maybe I'll buy them from Express. Literally everyone is here in the neighborhood right now. Oh, this is um the pink stork. So sweet, look how cute. They even have a little pink stork sticker. This is the new tea that I got that they sent to me. After I mentioned them on Instagram, they offered to send me a free one, which was so sweet, unnecessary. Oh, it smells delicious. So this one's caffeine free, and this one is called Uplift, and it is a Oh, it's lime. So it's a postpartum mood tea. So it's supposed to help you like get in a better mood when your hormones are going crazy. All right, I gotta go. Just a bunch of other, what is this? <gasps> Yay! Okay, actually I'm gonna put this in the beginning of the vlog because I wanna show you guys. I am so stinking excited. Until this loads. Get ready. These are so cute. My baby would have a problem if I had a girl. Did you get, we just got home from Target. Do you wanna show what you got? Well, I can get. You got cars? I got cars. I got him this um, Hot Wheels. I told him he could get one toy. First he was playing with a $60 fire truck and I was like, uh, let's move on. So he picked out Hot Wheels, of course. And every time I'm like, you know, we're gonna go to Target. It's gonna be fun and relaxing. Why do I think that? It's never fun and relaxing. Um, I decided I needed to get some pictures because we don't have like pictures of the kids around the house. Oh, I did get this. This is kind of like a random thing that I saw as I was walking towards the checkout, but it's like these little balls and they're like sticky, squishy, sticky, stretchy by Crayola. So I thought that would be fun for Cal to play with. And I got, bottle of wine, rose, um, this $5. They have like this whole, this brand, California Roots, it's $5. I had it last weekend. I can't remember if it was good or not. Um, so I'm sure it was fine. So I got another bottle of it. And then the main reason I really wanted to go there besides getting a Starbucks and getting out of the house was to print out some pictures um, for like photos. We have like frames and stuff around the house that None of them have our kids in them because that's how long it's been since I've printed out pictures. So it took me like 20 minutes to print pictures out on that stupid kiosk and the whole time Cal had his cake pop and he's, run, he's like trying to run around. He's like, let's go, let's go. He was being very good for a two and a half year old. So that's why he got the toy. So yeah, that's all I got. I'm pretty proud of myself. I went in and just got like three things. Okay, here's what those long shorts look like. I got them thinking they would be cute with like a sh like a t-shirt and stuff, but um, what baby? I got a car. You got a car and your brother's crying. <laughs> Anyways, maybe they're cute for the gym. I'll show you the other pair in a minute. Do you want to show the other shorts we got? Okay, these are the other ones. I feel like camel toe. 
But I think these are cute for working out in. Oh. oh. Right? It's hard to see. I know it's bad lighting in here, but I think they're going to be cute for the gym. They've got like a little bit of mesh on them and they're basically like yoga pants and they're just chopped off. You want some camera time? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! It's your bedtime. Time for me to feed you and put you down. Yeah. You're gonna go down for, for the whole night. Yeah, and mama and dada are gonna watch some TV tonight. And I'm gonna drink some wine. <laughs> You guys having pizza? Yeah, they were too, homie. Yeah, I want to show. Me too, homie. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to close out the vlog for today. I hope you enjoyed our little Is that here? slay at home Is that mom here? life. What? Get off the chair. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I, think, I think I'm going to film another. Uh, Friday night wine chat. So that's what I'm gonna go do. Then we're gonna watch Shane Dawson's new thing tonight. We're gonna eat pizza. It's gonna be a good Friday night. So I will see you guys in my next video. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications because I don't think I'm gonna keep up with this weird schedule that I've been doing. I think I just wanna go back to the randomness. So make sure your bells are turned on and I will see you guys next time. Bye. As long as you're with me